Here is my water softener and what we're going to do today is we're going to reset the time that it flushes out. That should be done at 2 o'clock in the morning. And that's something that is set right inside the little motor. We're going to take a look. I've lost power and I think it's flushing out when it probably shouldn't be. So we're going to take a look at that. So we will need to take the top off. There are a couple clips, one right here, that one has broken off. And then we do have one down here that we're just going to move it up and over and take that right off. And that shows us the internal parts. And this is what we're going to be dealing with. So now that I have the cover off, I can see that it thinks that it's 9 a.m. in the morning. We've lost power a few times over the winter time, and we've lost almost three and a half hours. So everything is all set up to be flushed out at two o'clock. You would want to call your service repair guy and just ask him what time the last time they serviced it, did they set it for the flushing? But all we're gonna do is, we need to set it for t time right now. It's about 12.15. So I'm gonna pull the whole knob out, and I'm just gonna turn it Right now it's set for noon, so I'm going to go probably one more click, and that's probably around 12.30. So it's all set now to go back to flushing out at 12 o'clock. We don't have to touch anything here. You'll notice that one of these is pushed in a little bit, and that's going to be set for the day. Every six days it's going to do the flushing. Right now it's set on the, the service, and it just goes around. So I'm all set now, it only takes a few minutes, but if you hear it flushing out you know, during the day when you're home or at night in the evening, you know, you, you do want it flushing out when everybody's sleeping and nobody's using any of the water. So I'm just gonna put the cover back on, make sure it snaps into place, and we're all set. Hope that helped and good luck.